kulima ongeze ni kilimo hatutakije na jai rudi kenya ali afternoon at the komol farm the wheels of a planter are turning set for a task that is the beginning of a new season this is the phase of mechanized agriculture 26 year old felix kili is a bachelor of agriculture engineering graduate from jk uat as a young kid i used to see videos of other countries people were doing farming and it seemed really cool and that's one of the things that motivated me i've always seen my dad uh, working on the farm and i always wanted to be like him he has really encouraged us he has uh, showed us that you need to work hard in order to achieve the things that you want while most young people may consider farming old fashioned on this farm the methods are anything but old the technology that is coming into the country is uh, it's no longer boring i mean you're getting into the tractors the tractors are noise free you are you're having acs you're using uh, gps and everything so it's it's an interesting field for the youth to venture into this planter has a gps sensor connected to over 20 satellites you don't even need to operate it you just enter the settings and it does all the work all i'm doing over here is just monitoring and seeing that everything is okay because at times you know there might be too much cloud cover and uh, you're getting uh, low reception so it will function well so techmat is this planter that it recognizes an already planted area this is how the field looks like so if we zoom this is where we currently are you can see this is already painted yellow so that means we have already planted this point over here we've not planted so what i'm going to do i'm going to put the planter down to be ready for planting uh i'll engage everything and i'll drive off when it reaches the point where i've not planted it will switch itself on and start planting so it doesn't do double planting the advantages of this planter are numerous it has reduced the operation cost for the farmer and it has also increased the the yields it can be able to uh set the spacing and uh, it will give us the spacing that we want in terms of depth of seed that is very important because if you place your seeds uh not on the correct depth if they are too deep they'll germinate but they won't come out of the ground if they are too shallow you'll find that most of them will not even germinate because they are not reaching the moisture level it has uh, two hoppers one is for fertilizer and the other one is for seed so this means you can be able to apply your fertilizer and the seed at the same time this planter can do an average of 60 acres per day felix targets 800 acres in less than 2 weeks you can see the rains are almost here so we are trying to to rush and uh, beat the time so that when the rains are coming all the seeds are in the ground normally we produce around 40 bags of maize per acre mechanized agriculture doesn't entirely mean loss of jobs komol farm still employs people for various tasks when you're filling the planter we require people who are going to put the fertilizer and the seeds into the planter uh, you'll always require somebody to be on the planter to keep on checking whether everything is running on smoothly komol farm has also put in place stringent measures to deal with the possible invasion by fall armyworms which drastically reduced harvests last season we've been uh, engaging uh chemical companies trying to get to know what products they are offering for the control of fall armyworm and this year we've already stocked our our stores with the fungicides that the, the insecticides that have worked and uh we are we are doing a lot of scouting when the maize will be coming out we'll have people will be walking around the fields so does felix plan to leave this trade in future we need food security and we know that The best people to do that is the youth. So I want to encourage the youth 
to get interested in farming, you can always, if you have one acre, five acres at home, try and do something that your parents haven't been doing, bring a, a bit of more difference because, I mean, you've been educated, you need to show the, the country that you have the power and the capability to change things. With mechanized agriculture being a key component in improving food security, it is expected that the government will provide more incentives to make farm machinery affordable. Ruth Mutegi for Farm Talk in Soi, Wasingishu County.